Only about 500 people have traveled in space, so most of humanity's views of space have been through the medium of photography. Many famous pictures of space travel have captured the imagination of Earth-bound audiences. Images such as the pale blue dot, the big blue marble, Voyager's close-ups of Saturn and Jupiter, astronauts and cosmonauts shaking hands in orbit, Buzz Aldrin standing on the moon, and Ed White floating in space. All of these photos share a common heritage, the first photo from space, taken high over the southwest United States. After the end of World War II, the United States military snapped up Werner von Braun's rocketeers in Operation Paperclip, shuffling the German rocket scientists off to the desert of White Sands, New Mexico. Here, in the vast emptiness of the southwest, von Braun's scientists were given access to the captured equipment from their V-2 days and instructed to build follow-on missiles with extended range and payload-carrying abilities. Among the captured V-2 equipment were entire unfired V-2 rockets. The Germans tinkered with the war machines, recalibrating the gyroscopes and aligning the rocket vanes to carry the payloads to higher altitudes. On October 24, 1946, the 13th post-war V-2 was launched in a near-vertical configuration. Inside the nose of the rocket, a 35mm motion picture camera was bolted next to an inspection porthole and aimed perpendicular to the direction of travel. A steel ball bearing in a tube leaned against a lever that sat atop the camera's shutter release. When the engine thrust ceased after 45 seconds, the ball bearing, and everything else in the ship, would experience zero gravity and would no longer be pressing down on the lever. The shutter clicked at an altitude of 65 miles. This is the first image created by that action. The camera took another picture every 1.5 seconds for the rest of the trip as the V-2 coasted up to an altitude of 107.5 miles before falling back to Earth. The ship impacted on the desert floor a few minutes later, destroying the rocket and the camera, but leaving the sturdy frame of the film cassette unscathed. Before the launch, the most distant photos of Earth were taken from balloons at an altitude of 13 miles. This mission moved that record to an altitude five times the previous height. This photo, showing the curvature of the Earth and taken from the edge of space, can easily be considered the first photograph of the space age. Visit BAE.com for more surprising space facts.